he called stream sniper. I saw they went live and I'm just like, ah, <laughs> I didn't realize they were gonna stream. Oh well. Key cult update, who cares? I'm just kidding, I love key cult. I was told there will be a giveaway. Yes, there will be a couple giveaways today. A couple giveaways. Should have bought a chair for your mom? Hey. Yeah, maybe. Perfect timing, Wardell just ended. Whoa, Grace, hello. You watch Wardell? What? You watch Wardell, Grace? I don't know. Man, I wish I was energetic like him. He has so much, he's so full of life. I'm envious of people who are high energy. I'm very low energy. <laughs> How about coffee taste? This coffee is really good. Uh, I got a picture of the bean. I forgot what bean I'm eating. It's from Maru. Ever since that one per- Oh my goodness. Ever since that person sent me beans from Maru, I've been trying it out. It's their El Paraiso Colombia bean. Chemex or espresso? Chemex. Oh my goodness, what are all these gifted subs? What the heck? Um, Mwaz, thanks so much for the bits. Average tacos, thanks so for the five gifted subs. Holy moly, thank you so much. Why are you it's average nice tacos? Thing. Why not dank tacos? Verdonix, thank you so much for the three months. Silence, thank you so much for the tier one subs. Silkers, thank you so much for the two bits. I ran out of space, thank you so much for the five gifted subs. Holy moly. Two people gifting, five off the bat. The Ploki, thanks for the two months. Wardell is awesome. Yeah. Well, Commander thank Bird, thank you so much for the four months. Calvin Tank Tank, thank you for the prime. Silence with the 100 bits. Thank you, thank you. Knack Nick with the tier one. Saint Adam with the three months. Cheeseball G with the five months. Maki Atori, thank you for the three months. Thank you for considering these cubes. <laughs> uh, Ixian Indigo, thanks for the one year. Thank you. Barnumbi with the 11 months. Julia Media with the seven months. Man Manoli Visuals with the three months. Tur Tubba Joe, thank you so much for the prime. Tactiles with the biz, Mr. Fleebo with the one year, thank you so much. Rhythm with the 13 months, X Dummy with the prime, Pyramid with the four months, Aliwag with the two months, Hold My Dingo with the three months, Sweeney, thank you so much for the prime, Henry, thank you so much for the five months, <sighs> Created by Eric with the two months, Star You, thank you so much for the prime. I can tell from watching your stream hobby. Keyboards are about to be the next thing I get really into. Nice. Did you see coffee industry is getting wrecked by global warming? Uh, I saw the headliner for one of the articles, but I didn't actually read it. What was the uh, content of the article? Is there actually going to be a bean shortage? Are we actually in a coffee crisis? <clears throat> Cute mug, thank you. We'll get me first to custom kin next week. It's not mine. <laughs> not mine. Buy coffee stocks right now. Uh, Sidemon, thank you so much for the three months. We'll get me first custom kit next week. Nice. How dare you drink coffee during this crisis? Bruh. I need coffee every day. Focus sharp. Focus harder. Thanks for the five bits. Uh, Khan, thanks for gifting us. Uh, Matthew, thanks for the tier one. Beer man with the three months. Mr. Raj, daddy, thanks for the bits. What is your honest opinion on the glorious panda after all the drama? I will wait until I can try out their switches. Digital hex, thanks for the tier one. Infamous nobody, thanks for the prime. Recom, Pensator, things are the prime. Clever Pup, things are the prime. Azurio, things are the five months. I feel like the, the whole glorious panda. Would that be a good YouTube video to make? Might be a good YouTube video to make. I uh, hope you've started planning out the dedicated cat stream because you might actually hit it. I did. I purchased a 50 feet HDMI cable. It should come one of these days. <laughs> it will be a juicy video to make. Yeah, maybe. I would most likely imagine uh, any of the uh, 
assuming they do send it out to tech tubers, they probably won't care much about the history of holy pandas or know much about it. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised if. Yeah. <laughs> Did you see the review of your setup on YouTube by Harris Hiller? Yes, I did. I commented on that video. By the time you upload it, people probably won't care too much. True. It might take me like three months to pump out that video, so maybe it might not even matter. <laughs> Why are you always streaming when I'm working? Sorry, Mr. Fleebo. Every tech tuber knows that the tooling was destroyed? Really? Can you do a setup tour? I definitely will. Uh, a bit off the topic, but is the Herman Miller chair the best? Getting mad back and shoulder pain after long hours of gaming. Um, if you are looking for a chair that's going to make you sit upright, I would say so. The Herman Miller is only comfortable when you're sitting upright. If you're someone who like who likes to slouch, uh, I personally wouldn't recommend the Aeron. Um, a lot, of, a lot of people complain it doesn't come up high enough in the back, but I kind of like that for a productivity chair. Like if you have a headrest, it just lets me just zone out sometimes. Whereas this chair, if you want to sit comfortably, you have to sit upright, and I do prefer sitting upright when I'm like in the zone. So I do I do like that. Uh, in terms of support, I find that it has most of the support I need. Um, I do wish I could bring these, these uh, armrests in. Like you can angle it, but I want to physically move them closer so like it hugs my tummy. That's the only thing this doesn't have. The embody, you can do that. With the embody, you can actually bring the, uh, the arms in closer. But for me, the Aeron felt more comfortable, at least for my, my butt. Steel case Leap V2 has that as well. Yeah, I've heard a lot of great stuff about steel case. Uh, if the budget allows, I do want to build out another setup. Maybe for that, I'll consider picking up a steel series. Not steel, yeah, steel case. Oh my goodness, what? Sam Sheffer. <laughs> Thank you so much for the Prime, what the heck? We have Mr. Sam Sheffer in the house chat, holy. Thank you so much for the Prime. Uh, Captain Space, thank you for the Prime. Holden, thank you so much for the Tier 1. Fatty Matty, thank you so much for the Prime. Thrice with the 3 months. Um, Aqua Fisher with the 7 months. Wendell Worms with the Prime. Killy Pino, thank you so much for the Tier 1. Teclad, Tecladito, thank you so the Prime. Melvin VC with the Prime. Kaizen Fennec with the 1 year, thank you, thank you. Packed out with the 200 bits. Uh, are you getting the Kara? I definitely will purchase one if I'm not being sent one. Bresky with the Prime. Gabbers with the Prime. Alberto Lou with the Prime. Donut Boy with the Prime. Battle War with the two months. Corporate B with the four months. Uh, glad to be back in the stream while you're moving. I have to go back to college. Ooh, college. I don't miss college. <laughs> Matthew thinks with 300 bits. Mayori with the two months. Thank you, thank you. <clears throat> Somebody redeemed push-ups? Are you kidding me? Oh my goodness. I'll do it at the end of the stream. How are you guys doing? Uh, I might. I might also be streaming tomorrow, guys. Maybe, not guaranteed, I might stream tomorrow. We'll see. Is that a porno set in the back? What about this looks like a porno set? What? What makes this look like a porno set? I don't understand. <laughs> Coward let me in? How did you come up with the name Teha? That's my Korean name, Sam. <laughs> uh, I can't say I came up with it. I guess my, my grandparents came up with it for me. Yeah, it's my Korean name. And then just types. Uh, well, actually, one of my friends recommended I should call myself Teha Types. 
So I can't, I can't technically claim originality for that combo. Yeah. So I've got this whole branding scheme going on. Taya Types for my main keyboard content. Taya Snipes is my gaming channel. And then I recently started an OnlyFans called Taya Pipes. <laughs> I actually don't, I'm not an OnlyFans person. I just claimed it solely for branding purposes. <laughs> solely for branding purposes. Please don't actually subscribe. Don't expect content there. <laughs> and then and then a friend of mine, Christopher Yi, came up with a great idea. The day I retire, I just turn all my channels into past tense. You'll know I retire when Tea Types becomes Tea Typed. Tea Sniped. Tea Piped. Ooh. And then I just disappear from social media. Jennifer, hello. <laughs> this is smart. <laughs> Teha wiped? Ooh. Uh, is it common to choose an American name when moving? Yes, I do have an American name. So I used to go by Nathan before. Um, I just felt like Teha was kind of a more unique name. It stands out. Nathan doesn't really, I guess, stick in your mind as nicely as Teha does. Teha just kind of sets me apart a little bit. So I decided to use my Korean name. But I, my American name is Nathan. There's a million Nathans? Probably, yeah. <laughs> uh, but will Tea Tapes go to Tea Tapes since it's already past Vogue? Ooh, that's some deep meta, meta questions right there. Don't know why a lot of Asian have Nguyen last name. It's a very popular Vietnamese last name. I think Kim, no, actually, is Kim... Are there more Kims than Nguyen's out there? I'm actually not sure. I don't know what the population size is between Vietnam versus Korea. <laughs> I might wager there's more Kims, no? I know more Nguyen's than Kims, really. A ton of Parks? I'm pretty sure there's more Kims than Parks. Pretty sure there are? Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Kim Gang Rise Up. Uh, what is the emblem next to my name? Is this the scam train? Yes. Thank you so much for the scam train, everyone. I don't know a single Park. What? Park is a very common Korean last name. <clears throat> Did you see the new Korean law that lets Faker and BTS postpone military? No, I haven't. Nathan still cannot pronounce my name. Okay, it's okay, sorry. Your name's actually really hard. I don't know how to do it. <laughs> I still don't even know how to spell it. I know you've shown me a couple times. You can use Stanislaw? Okay, I'll just call you Stanislaw. <laughs> uh, the command dog things with the prime, talk things with the four months, don't know what the prime, raid the roads with the tier one, long life stick with the 16 months, 12 in the PM with the prime, visual murder with the bits, Arnav with the prime, the Kanya with the eight months, Pudsy with the 19 months, yo, Pudsy. Uh, not Scooter with the three months is the new set for the uh, E. coli, I think it's for the tier one sub. Abe Ziz, thanks for the tip. Hope you're having a good day. How often do you switch your keyboards? I switch my keyboards around every two weeks. And if you had to go back and tell your younger self what your favorite switch of all time is, now that you've tried so many, can only choose one, what would it be? It would be good vintage blacks. Good ones. Juggernaut, thanks for the prime. Jam with the tier one. Super Sebi, thanks for the prime. Swirly G with the prime as well. All right, I guess I'll do the 10 push-ups. This is for Tomasi. I don't know if he's here. I guess I'll start this stream off with some exercise. I couldn't eat lunch today, feels bad. Ago. Wait, someone else claimed? Okay, this is for Vinan. Another 10. <sighs> ah! They have pumps? Should that be my, should that be my workout channel? They have pumps? Tail lifts. 
Oh, I'm hot now. It's hot. Is that his elbow cracking? Yes, both my elbows and knees crack. <sighs> they had dumps. They had gains. That's a good one too. Uh, let me turn up the AC. It was it was getting it was cooling down in California for the past couple days, and then it got hot again. Heat wave again? Yeah, it's getting hot again in California. Feels bad. Rockham Rackham LaRue, single tip. Wondering where your t-shirt is from. This t-shirt? Uh, it's from Only NY. I'm gonna guess they're based in New York. This was a collab piece they did with some artist. I forget the artist. Oh, it's Paul. Oh, Saul. But the company is Only NY. I don't know, I kind of like this like spooky, spooky, creepy artwork. I liked it. <sighs> no regrets. Thanks for the four months. Epostle, thanks for the prime. Silence with the bits. Yes, if you go uh, hot swap, you do not need to swatter. I, I would highly recommend it for your first build. Jim not Tim with the prime. Fact with the prime. Snaggy low with the prime. Jacob T. Lu with the Prime as well. All right, should we, I'm gonna give away a couple sets to stream. Should we start off the stream with a giveaway? I think that's a good idea. Okay, you guys have a choice. Um, Dixie Mech has extended GMK Minimal for one more day. So I can purchase someone a set of GMK Minimal. GMK Beta is also live. So one of those two sets, all right. Vote yes if I should give away a GMK Minimal set or no for GMK Beta. Yes for Minimal, no for Beta. Oh, it's hot, why is the AC not turning off? <laughs> Hello? I guess it just won't turn on. All right, looks like we're gonna give away a set of GMK Minimal. And if you guys don't know what GMK Minimal looks like, I will show you guys the set. Uh, how should we do a give? Wait, it's sold out. Dixie said it was gonna be live for another day. Oh wait, it's, it's an old listing. I lied, I lied, I lied. Oh, we can still purchase. All right, this is what GMK Minimal looks like, chat. I will be giving away one base kit for someone. Pretty clean, pretty clean set. Or should I just purchase them one of each kit? Should I just give out base kits or one of each kit? If I do base kits, I can give out more. If I purchase every kit, then I would only pick a couple winners. Base kit only? I think base kit only, just for simplicity's sake. All right, we're gonna give him one of these. Let me bring up Nightbot. Oh, whoops, black bars are still there, should not be there. Nightbot. And we are gonna be building a keyboard today. A fully 8008 decked out keyboard. Uh, keyword, what should the keyword be? Uh, keyword should be boobs? <laughs> no, that's not, I don't want someone new on this channel to do. <laughs> Look at the stream spamming boob and get deterred from it. <laughs> Let's just do <laughs> minimal is clean. Minimal is clean. That's that's the keyword. Anyone can enter. Mods, regular subscribers, users. Minimal is clean. 
Uh, Bethan Morai, thanks for the Prime sub. Attorney Aaron, thanks for the Tier 1 sub. I will pick a winner in 5 minutes. At 1.30, I'm going to pick a winner. Savnak, thanks for the Prime. Chafalama, thanks for the Prime. Carrot the Wizard, thanks for the Tier 1. Senpai Knight with the Tier 1. Ginger Powder with the Prime. Makenta, thanks for the Tier 1. Ponizu with the Tier 1. Schwarz Bruder with the Tier 1. Subtle Toes with the Tier 1. Pixel Boo with the Tier 1. Oh, crap. Uh, Bill Belt Buckle with the Tier 1. Zippy B, thanks for the Prime. I Milk with the Tier 1. K-Pop Chicken with the Prime. Fearless Asia with the Tier 1. Aliha with the Tier 1. BBD with the Tier 1. Zodiac with the Tier 1. Dakai with the Tier 1. Superman's Brother, thanks for three months. Pilots with the Prime. John Trambo with the Tier 1. Sack Lunch with the Prime. Quail Legs with the Tier 1. Wet Buns with the Prime. Queen of What with the Tier 1. Fortitude with the Prime. Holy moly, so many people today. Navion Kun with the Tier 1. Sucks. Naxer, thanks for the Tier 1. Boosts and Bruise with the Tier 1. Breathing Falls with the Forma. Sky Dogi with the Prime. Captain Jack with the Prime. <sighs> Holy crap. I need to turn on the AC. Why is this not turning on? All right, how are you guys doing? Jay Riddle, thank you so much for gifting a sub. <sighs> Big Tuna TV, thank you so much for the tier one. Potato Puff with the Prime. <clears throat> and if you guys are wondering why I'm giving away sets, uh, I don't know if you guys follow me on Twitter, but yesterday I tweeted about how I wanted the all-black Herman Miller Aeron chair. The special gaming edition that, uh, don't know why it's gaming edition, but it's all black and it's gaming. So I just tweeted about how I wanted it. And then some kind gentleman who I will keep private, uh, <laughs> let's just say they PayPal'd me some money to help fund the purchase. And I guess they didn't know I had an Aeron already. Um, I offered to refund it, and then they threatened to just re return it back to me, so I was like, okay, I'm just gonna give it away to my viewers. <laughs> I mean, I, I could I could use it to buy another Aeron, but I don't need to. Yeah, but thank you. I forgot I scheduled a meeting at the same time as the stream. I'm here? Okay, toxic Mr. Dixie, I'm just kidding. Oh, it's in sub mode? Whoops. Who put it in sub mode? All right, it's no longer sub mode. Picking a winner in one minute. You guys have one minute. One minute. At 1.30, I will pick a winner. Saucy Hot Wheels with three months. Chicken with two months. Ayakase with the two months, Dylan Ross, Dylan Johnson with the prime, Alec, oh Alec with the prime. We, WLTO, I think it was tier one. Ben Jarvis with the three months, New User with the prime, Adolfo with the tier one, Frog O with the prime, Cozinius with the prime, Karori with the tier one. What? Akmahoat, Akmahoathan. Holy, thank you so much for the tip. I always had your stream running on the side when I was grinding lead code. It was a difficult six month job for me, but I finally got into Google as a software engineer. Yo, this man got into Fang. All right, $50, nothing to this man now. $50 is chump change to Akma Hawaiian now if you got into Google as a software engineer. This is my thank you to you for being a good streamer. Oh my goodness, thank you so much. Congrats on Google. I'm very glad your days of grinding on lead code paid off. I know how that feels. <laughs> it's, Ms. it's me, Zephy, thanks for the prime. Alex, Roman, Iris, thanks for three months. Thank you, thank you. Coco Beans with the prime. Olive, Lofi, thanks for the tier one. WWP Mustang, thanks for the prime. All right, the Olive with the tier one, thank you. Picking a winner in three, two. We have 1,120 eligible users. Three, 
two, one. Royal Star Killer. You have a minute to claim this. Are you here in chat, Royal Star Killer? Do you claim this? Royal. Oh, 20 seconds. Still haven't responded. Maybe not here. Maybe he's a bot. Oh, he said hi. Do you claim this set? Do you claim the set? Why do they never just say? <laughs> Why is... do you claim the set? Why is everyone's first message high? <laughs> Stream delay? It's not this long. Come on. Yes, I see he's here, but do you claim the set? He claimed it? Is it just Nightbot being slow? This man still hasn't claimed. Does he not want? <laughs> yes, I do. Make sure it's not a bot. How do I make sure it's not a bot? Do I go to view profile? I mean, I don't know how you can confirm it's not a bot. All right. Royal Star Killer. GMK minimal base. Thank you so much. But why am I thanking them? <laughs> Get me a... Uh... Get me, DM me your use, or your shipping information. I'll get this handled for you. Check his profile. How do you check his profile? How do you view logs? How do you view the logs of a person? I don't know how to do that. Check his profile? Wait, I, I clicked on his profile. Doesn't show me anything about his chat log though. You can check their logs in mod view. I do not have mod view on. <laughs> I don't think he has a bot. I don't think so. He replied. He just probably has slow internet connection. All right. Don't worry, chat. We're going to be giving more of these away. Uh, where should I DM you? Uh, Twitch, Discord, email, all fine. All right. Shall we get to the build? Let's get to the build. So, we did show this off already. Dixie showed this off. Uh, he showed it on his Instagram once. Oh my goodness. Key James Shifri, thanks for the six gift of subs. Holy, thank you so much. Gabriel Guisado, you're back. Thank you so much for the tip. My friend has a very smelly dog called Bambino. Can you tell my friend Raphael to wash him? All right, Raphael, please wash your smelly dog. X Midi, thanks for the two months. Gabriel, thanks for the tip. Walk and vlog, thanks for the two months. McBrien, thanks for the two months. This is the Dixie Mech Mecha Keyboard. I'm sorry, the Mech. Mechai Bodo case. Uh, he did post an Instagram story on his page, but I'd have the first. Uh, this is a prototype. He said there were going to be some changes made. We're going to take a look at this. Uh, the peak, thanks for gifting a sub. Oh my goodness, Fox and Knife, thanks for the 10 give the sub. What the heck? Uh, Barrett, TW, thanks for two months. Kiko with the raid. Oh my goodness, thank you. I'm sorry I stream sniped. I went live shortly after you guys went live. Sorry, Kiko, but hopefully the uh, the stream went well. How are you guys doing? What uh, what big announcement did I miss? <laughs> nice second cam angle, thank you, Sam. All right, this is what the case looks like. So compared to the TX case, uh, this is much slimmer. Very slim. 
that's got this nice little tag. I'm gonna guess that also says Mekai Kibodo. Um, it's got Dixie's logo right there. Look at this tab. They said the announcement wasn't really big. Uh, look at this. It's got Dixie on one side. And it's got that. But I like this, I like this dual color. I like this black, red, and white color scheme going on. I like. I'm actually kind of jealous of his uh, zipper tab. Looks very nice. Um, it's got Dixie's logo up here. This is obviously the same. I believe the text as the uh, Mecha desk mat, also available on Dixie's website. It's Mecha Kibodo. Oh, Mecha Kibodo. Mecha Kibodo. There you go. But it is a little bit slimmer. Oh, it's even ribbed for pleasure right here. And it's got some nice grooves for your fingers. Um, this kind of reminds me of the cases that Canon Keys. Uh, keyboard or shipping out and I feel like this is a, a similar style Ooh, And then we take our first look Into these new switches that are upcoming These are the 8008 inks and We're gonna talk about it. We can talk about it a little bit So yes, these are recolored Um Technically the same mold as Gateron Ink V2s. Uh, the spring is a Gateron yellow spring. So I talked to Dixie. He really liked the sound of Gat, Ink v Gat Inks. And his favorite spring was the Gateron yellow. So he wanted to combine both of those, I guess. Uh, it is slightly different though, in a sense. Gat Inks are made with different plastics. This is a... This isn't a translucent housing. So technically the plastic composition is different. So we'll see how it sounds. But I mean, it's still a Gateron switch. I haven't lubed these, these are completely stock. Um, they are gonna go live on September 6th. So two days from now, they will go live and they will run until the 20th of this month. Unlimited group buy, you can purchase as many as you want, no limit. They will be 75 cents a switch. Um, so definitely on the pricier side, but pretty standard for recolored Gateron switches. Uh, Dixie Mech will be the NA proxy, mykeyboard.eu for EU folks, uh, Illum keyboards, as well as Daily Clack, all will be proxying these switches. They are not live, they're going live September 6th. September 6th, two days from now. Ooh, wait! Dixie's keyboard case comes with a TIA types microfiber cloth? What? <laughs> oh, three days, sorry, three days, three days. Uh, let's take a look at this. Um, there will be changes made. So Dixie said he's gonna add straps. Um, there's no straps currently to secure your keyboard. The foam is pretty secure. And I believe all of, yeah, all of these inserts, uh, they're removable. You can position them wherever you want. I think Dixie said there's a total of like 16 of these inside here. So pretty, pretty organizable, but this one doesn't have straps. Um, this is also something that he's planning to keep in stock, but uh, for now, this is still a prototype. Wait, where are all the inserts? Okay, I guess this is a prototype. A total of six? All right, I misheard during the call. He said six inserts. Okay, this only has two inserts, but the production one will have six inserts. All right, but this case, I like. Wait, wait, wait. All right, Dixie. I am now going to become the Jerry Rig of keyboard streamers. We must put this through a durability test. Does Dixie stand by his own case? We will find out. Let's see. Assuming this pandemic is over, you wanna go to a keyboard meetup with this Mecca Kibodo case with an expensive 
four to five hundred dollar bower in here. <laughs> and you're, you're walking to your meetup, and then whoa! Did it break? Or maybe. Maybe you're late to the meetup because you grabbed a cup of coffee and you're trying to drink your coffee. Oh, oh. You trip. Is that gonna break the keyboard? Or maybe you just have butterfingers. And then you, whoa, you slip. Let's find out if this bower is safe. <laughs> I mean, my, my keyboard case has proved the test of time. Is this bower going to be scuffed? Well, the mayo if it's broken. Oh, that's gonna be big sad. <laughs> All right, moment of truth. Ooh, pristine. Not a single scratch on the anodization. Or sorry, Cerakote. Look at this. Not a single dent or scratch. All right, the Mecca, the Mecca Kibodo case passes the durability test. Um, I was also sent a desk mat to use for the stream. So let's see what this desk mat is. <clears throat> Now you won't? No, I'm not gonna throw it. This isn't my personal board, unfortunately. Uh, this is this is actually Mr. Dixie's board, so. If it was mine, maybe I would have, but. Wait, what desk mat is this? This is not the 8008. Ooh, this is the dual shot desk mat. Look at this. I actually didn't have one of these, Dixie. Thank you. Ooh. Ja -ja. This is a sick desk mat. I don't know if you guys, looks like a PlayStation 1. Yeah, this is what it's meant to uh, mimic. Uh, GMK DualShot, which ran, I believe earlier this year. It was a keycap set based after this color scheme. Ooh, I like. PS1 TOS. <laughs> Very nice. Oh, December last year, all right. Yes, I lied. Ooh. Very nice. Shall we get to building this? Um, the PCB. All right, we have a PCB here. Also set this. Okay, chat, we have a couple options. So Dixie tried to build up a keyboard and then he stopped. <laughs> Do you guys want, I feel like we've built enough bowers with palm plates. No, this isn't palm, what is this? What material is this Dixie? Do I desolder this half built keyboard and use this plate? Or do we stick with the acrylic? Just keep the pink? I think we'll stick with the pink. I do like the pink. It uh, fits the theme. Will the 8008 come back? Uh, the keycap set, I'm not too sure. Whoa. Uh, I wouldn't be surprised if it does come back, but for now, it will not be coming back anytime soon. 
The other is the backup one, yeah. What camera do you use? Uh, I use the EOS R for both my face cam and the top down cam, Mr. Sam. Uh, I, I initially joined in on the pre-order for the R5 and then all the overheating stuff happened so I canceled <laughs> and then I joined the pre-order for the R6 and then that still had its issues. Not as bad but uh, some of my streams do run long sometimes so I just said you know what I'm gonna save some money just bought another EOS R. All right, uh, where is my Via? Hmm, why is Via not detecting this? <laughs> Wait. I text getting auto mode for some reason. Do you have a link to the MX series? Wait a minute. No Sony A7S III. No Sony A7S III, unfortunately. Uh, I just switched out of the Sony ecosystem. I can't afford to switch back. This is why Dixie sent us two. Uh, he did warn me beforehand this PC might not be working. We might just have to desolder that previous build. Let's see if it's the daughter cables issue. Maybe it's the port. Not the port. <laughs> okay. Maybe it's just the, the PCB. What program is he using to detect the keyboard? It's a program called VIA, V-I-A. Yeah, Dixie did warn me that it was, it might be borked. So that's why he sent me this half-built one because this one should work. Okay, this one does work. I was hoping it would work for you. Yeah, I think the PCB is just dead. All right, guess we'll do some uh, live, live desoldering. I mean, Dixie only like half built this, so it shouldn't take too long. How is the ESR good for videos? ESR is more than enough for streaming. I mean, it's definitely more than enough for streaming. For YouTube, it's also more than capable. Um, if you hook it up to the to any external recorder, you can get you can get 10-bit 422 out of it. Uh, you do have a massive crop, but I'm kind of used to the crop. So yeah, EOSR is more than plenty. Uh, let me bring out my desoldering gun. Will you lube the inks? I will not. I'm gonna do this. We're building, we're doing a raw build today. Bring out the big guns. What lens do you use to record? Face cam is the 15 to 35 RF lens. Top down is the 24 to 70 RF. I text getting auto mode for some reason. Do you have a link to the MX series building? Will this be on YouTube? Yes, it will. Is that a gun? Yes. This is a gun that goes brr. It actually goes brr. Uh, let me plug this in. Watch him burn the pads. If I burn the pads, that wouldn't be good. All right, looks like it is powering on. Set it to the right temp. Uh, I are sleepy, thanks for the tier one sub. Silence, thanks for the bits. My text getting auto mod for some reason. Do you have a link to the MX switches black? You can purchase them off Novel Keys. Mm. Fentario, thanks for the uh, two months. Kioski, thanks for the prime. Gabriel, thanks for the tip. Um. Okay, buddy. 
Not Barney things with the three months. Hello, silence things with the bits again. Prince David with the prime. False Sprite with the prime. Benny Boy with the prime. Maniac Asian things with the prime. Keeb Realtor with the tier one. Static. St Sat Acid things with the two months. Unio with the six months. Mel sells Bell with the tier one. Remdo with the eleven months. Andy. 65 with the Prime, Deterrent with the 4 months, Gucci with the Prime, Shrike, LB with the Prime, Pan, Panasha Fricks, thanks for the Prime, Frog, thanks for gifting us up, My Man Mart with the 19 months, Tyler the Gora with the Prime, Lil Pi with the 14 months. Okay. Pretty heated up now. Wait, what the heck happened here? Is it too loud? Should I mute myself? It's fine. I will leave the mic on. Sounds clogged, but it is sucking. Yo, Crowbit, hello. Maybe I will. What incarnation is that tool? It's a tool that actually lives up to the machine go brr meme. It's a desoldering gun. It does essentially the reverse of soldering. Yeah. Any Michael Reeves viewers in chat? Do you guys have his brr emotes? But like how? Um, so the tip, just like a soldering iron, it gets very hot. So when you apply it to the pad, um, it heats up the solder and melts it. And then whenever I go, brrr, if that's a vacuum running. So as it's heating up, once it's heated up enough, you go brrr, and it sucks up all that solder out. And then once you've sucked up all the solder, you can just plop the switches back out. Okay, that's sounding a bit healthier now. for some reason. Did you change the filter? I do change the filter. Um, I mean, I used this pretty recently. So I know it's not the filter. It is sucking, it's just, it sounds like it's clogged for some reason. Desk 
boy's brutal real man. Hello, Mr. Sovereign. Did you stream today, Sovereign? Ooh, Salvin! I purchased the uh, the Tokebi Artisan keycap yesterday. I have high expectation for the Tokebi aluminum Salvin keycap. <laughs> Ultimate expectations, yeah. Is it focusing on my hair again, Gigi? I'll try to not look at it. How are you guys doing? Yes, I'm use I'm desoldering this because that one doesn't work. But I was told beforehand by Dixie of my <laughs> We were just hoping it was a PC thing or a cable thing, but it doesn't work. What are those switches? These are Gateron yellows. I think the top rows were not desoldered as well. recommend buying desoldering iron uh desoldering iron does make it a lot easier uh whether it makes financial sense for you you're gonna have to decide if you're just gonna desolder one keyboard it's not really worth it to spend a couple hundred on a desoldering gun um, on the flip side if you're really scared of ruining a keyboard by desoldering 
maybe a desoldering gun is a good choice. Um, I, it's much easier to destroy pads with a pump or a wick than it is with a desoldering gun in my opinion. Uh, desoldering with a gun is significantly easier I would say. So up to you whether paying that couple hundred is worth the security. If you're going to desolder often, I would say a gun is very worth it. Oh, I got a DM. Oh, Salvin, I don't know if you're still here. I bought the uh, the GMK Red Devils, the Tokebi Artisan yesterday. Okay, I'm gonna redo all these top ones. Did you buy the keycap set? I did. I, I bought it just because I'm in Korea. I did, I did like the novelty keycaps for it. Plus it had hunger, hunger only. So I had to. These probably, some of these are okay. Just a couple more left. Good lord, that release set. Q3, wait, release date for a new keycap set? Or is that the ship date for GMK Red Nobles? I keep telling myself to stop buying keyboard stuff, but here I go. Same. <laughs> that one's still stuck? Okay. Wow, why are some of these still so tight? Okay, these are all still stuck. I'm sure if everyone just spams and do his push-ups, Someone else claimed push ups. is so stuck. Getting a little worried now. <laughs> I shouldn't need this much. Maybe I'll just feed it more. Feed it more solder, or I'm just gonna do this. Finally, catching a stream. Hello. Oh, my desk is a mess again. Uh, let's catch up. Tie fighter, thank you so much for the tier one sub. The real Stoia, thank you for the tip. Cheers from Italy. I'd like to stream about keyboard building, and crafting, but it seems there's not such an interest in Italy. Actually, I am even scared to start a stream work while studying and working. Maybe one day I'll make it. 
Uh, I mean, you don't necessarily need an interest in Italy. The keyboard hobby is pretty international. People from all over the world will tune in. Adrian things are the prime. Dexmex with the prime. Galaxy things are the bits. Sleepy oil things are the tip. Silence with the bits. Thank you so much. Do you recommend the cherry silent black or the linear black? I like both. Um, it's up to you if you prefer a silent switch or not. Davy Chan things are the bits. Uh, silent things are the bits. Uh, Persian Nike things are the four months. Excited for the new bag. Cover my keep every night with a tail microfiber cloth. <laughs> Uh, Nweni the poo, thanks so much. We need the poo, thanks so much for the tip. Uh, please compare the blocker to your big toe. I'm considering buying one. Okay, buddy. The birds, thanks so much for the prime. I'm not gonna compare a blocker to my toe. That's just kind of weird. Honestly, this method of desoldering is the best. Never lost. There you go. If you don't, if you don't want a desoldering gun, just heat up the pad as you pull. Okay. This is what we want. This PCB here. This is still hot. Don't touch. Okay. Let's plug this. Irene, hello, how are you doing? Have your keyboard parts arrived yet? I'm still waiting for the Irene build stream. Okay, Ooh, still being detected. Uh, and let us, let us pray the desoldering didn't damage anything. What phone do you use? Uh, I used to be an Android diehard for the majority of my life. I'm currently on my first iPhone ever. So I am currently an iPhone user. Uh, any questers? Okay, Wes. I'm good. I'm still waiting on the keycaps to hear back from the Cerakote shop. Ah, uh, yeah. Lots of delays in the hobby currently. Oh, okay. Woo. Uh, Dixie did not put a stab here. So I'm going to guess he did that on purpose. And just build this with split backspace. Uh, do you have a key for your phone? I do not. Well, you can just connect via Bluetooth to a phone. But I don't really type <laughs> with a keyboard on my phone. I try to not type on my phone whenever I can. If I ever do need to uh, do a lot of typing, I will just not do it on my phone and wait until I'm back on my PC. I'm not a big fan of typing long stuff on my phone. Uh, you actually cannot pull full black space. Plate does not allow it. You are correct. Okay, I should have looked at the plate. The plate is fixed. Nice. Also nice because that's one less stab to do. Uh, do you still lube your stabs with Teflon dielectric grease? I do not. I use Crytox 205 grade zero, but um, that old method that I use is still perfectly fine. I guess this is a function key here. All right, PCB works. SMH not turning on developer mode. I have to turn on developer mode? How do you turn on developer mode? I did lose test matrix, this latest patch. I don't have the test matrix anymore. I don't know what happened. I don't remember having to turn on a setting for it though, via version. Show design tab, fast key mapping, hardware, allow remapping. I'm not sure what happened. Just use switch header. No, via is the future, guys. All right, let's undo this. 
Honestly, these tabs don't feel that scratchy. But I'm just gonna replace it for Mr. Yixi. Hate not modern, hello. Also, guys, I am potentially planning a subathon for next Friday. I think I have secured items to give away for you guys. Thinking next Friday morning, I'll do a subathon. My two year anniversary was in July, <laughs> but I missed it because of the move. So it'll be a very belated two year anniversary subathon. Did you see Harris's review of your stream setup? I did. I tweeted about it. I also left a comment in the video. Uncapped? Yes, uncapped. Uncapped subathons only on this channel. Not all PCBs show the matrix thingy. That is true, but I feel like for Wilbur's PCBs, they should, no? I mean, this is a pretty old PCB too. But I could be wrong. I do, yeah, that, that is correct. Not all PCBs show it, but I haven't been seeing it on any of the PCBs as of late since I got to this place. I don't know if anyone else has done it, but should I do a 48 hour stream? Uh, there's definitely people who have done 48 or even longer. <laughs> During September 2, it's over for you. I'm thinking maybe I should make one of the prizes if we hit it. I release merch details. Twitch auto stops your stream after 48 hours? Wait, what? Since when? Since when did Twitch do that? Was that always a thing? Ed did 48 for his birthday. Will the giveaways be worldwide? That's a good question. Um, I've been having trouble with international shipments lately. I've had two of them. One of them has been stuck in transit for five months. Uh, one of them just straight up got returned to me after a couple months. So I'm wondering maybe for international winners, I just give you guys cash equivalent. Uh, shipping is pretty bad right now for international, I feel like. Okay, this one did not clip in. That stab doesn't... You're right, dang it. I did it by instinct. <laughs> you guys are right. You're very right. All right, one more stab. We need a 70 stable. Will there be any youth sizes? Oh man, a youth size? I don't think there's gonna be a youth size, unfortunately. Uh, I will most likely provide from X small to XX. I think XX large. I have to double check on XXX large. Okay, looks like I already lubed the housing on this. I just need to do the wire. Um, a Yogi, thanks for the Prime. Tomu-san, thanks for the two months. Quantum Monk, thanks for the tip. Got a quick question for I'm lubing some blueberry smart for a bill. Wondering your opinion on lubing the tactile bump or not with a particular switch. Uh, I personally would. Blueberries are pretty tactile for my taste. And lubing the leg is one way to reduce the tactility slightly. So I personally would. Um, there's, there's like this... Well, I wouldn't call it a misconception, but people generally recommend that you don't lube uh, the legs of tactile switches um, because yes, it will reduce the tactility depending on how much lube you apply, but it's a very big point of friction. So I don't think it's all that bad if you just apply a light, a very light coat. If you, if you are capable of applying a very thin coat consistently, Tactiles can be really nice if you lube the legs. But generally, it's frowned upon just because people tend to do it wrong and it just completely kills the tactility of tactile switches. 
Um, what do you think about Cat Mizu Blood Moon? I think I liked Mizu better. I don't know if it's because of a first impression sting or if I just don't like the, the Blood Moon color scheme. Um, is the Amp Pro too good for a starter keyboard? Yes. Personally, I think Celio's V262 gram are ridiculously tactile, so even Light 205, yeah, I agree. I completely agree. Some people really like that Chad level of tactility. Uh, I don't. <laughs> I just want a moderate amount of tactility. <sighs> Would you have medium and large? Yes. Oh, I meant to say every size from extra small to XX large. I didn't mean only extra small and XX large. I will have all the sizes in between. Sagan Prime, thank you so much for the 10 months. And we need to put in a bit. Today is my good friend Colbert birthday. Can we please get a birthday shout out for him? Oh yeah. Mr. Colbert or Miss Colbert. Happy birthday. Hope you have a good day. Eat some cake. Can we span some birthday emotes and chat for Mr. Colbert, Colbert, or Miss Colbert. Do you get tired of answering questions all day? Some questions, yes. <laughs> some, some very generic questions. I just kind of intentionally ignore now. <laughs> yes. Yes is the answer to your question. All right, let us... I need to open this case to access the plate. So let's do that next. I should also get rid of this. Why you ignore my question? I hate you forever, Tia types. What do you mean? When are you getting a new makeup bag? Not too sure. This PCB is scuffed, so I'm just gonna put these switches here. Have you noticed how often you wipe your hands? Uh, I do know I wipe it quite often. It's because I get lube. Like, once you touch lube, there is some residue. Where is the hex bits? Ooh, pull out the right one on the first try. How do you guys like this 8008 colorway? Yes or no? Was that PCB 100% dead or just not fully registered? It was 100% dead. Uh, Dixie said he couldn't get it to work on his computer. So we were hoping it was just a, maybe it's a cable thing, maybe it's a PC port thing. Sometimes just ports don't work with PCBs for some reason, but after trying it on my computer, it also does not work. Yes? Wow. That word makes me cringe so hard. What word? Wow? It's Smoaf, thank you so much for the Prime. PFKA Mouse Cop, thank you for the Prime. 
It worked the last time I tested it, must have gotten damaged in our move. Uh, GG. All right, question. Do you guys want a round two for Bauer? A lot of yeses. Okay. Wait. Oh, I lied. Ooh, look at this all pink. Okay, the majority of people want to bow around to Dixie. <laughs> Not that you needed to know, but aluminum plate. It's got the gasket supplied on top. Oh, it's been a while since I've seen the internals. I didn't realize it was just two giant strips on the bottom and three smaller ones up top. Interesting. It's been very long since I've opened up the flower. And this is the bottom here. Ooh, Wilba's saying no. Wilba does not want a bower. Can we just get a PCB on case that supports a normal layout? What do you mean? There's tons of keyboards like that. What do you mean? Unless your definition of normal layout is different from normal layout. There's so many keyboards that support normal layout. Oh, Mr. James Bardoff. Thank you so much for the five months. How are you doing? Okay, someone said I missed screws on spacebar. GG. <laughs> By normal, do you mean anti? That's what I assume. This is the power two. Uh, I don't think this is the Bauer 2. Maybe it is. I wouldn't know. I gave away my Bauer 1. It's been a while since I've seen the internals. Mr. James, when are you getting an when are you getting a legitimate uh, a legitimate custom mechanical keyboard. You have too many keyboards, James. I think you should consolidate into just a couple quality ones. That's toxic. <laughs> I'm just saying. I mean, Mr. James ha probably has like 30 entry to mid tier keyboards. He could, he could give those away like he does with his knives and then just have like five very nice keyboards, you know? Just saying. <laughs> um, I'm gonna test this with the Gateron Yellows. Are these lubed? Yeah, these are lubes. I'm gonna use these to test stabilizers. If it'll go through. What? Cassidy? Oh my goodness, thank you so much for the host. Hopefully you guys know who Cassidy is. She is a very top tier, one of the best software engineers in the world that I know, but she's also very big. <laughs> nope, okay, Soran. She's also an avid mechanical keyboard enthusiast. You guys might know her for her XDA Scrabble collab. Um, she's also made Ah, I forgot the name. <laughs> it's the uh, the astrology set. But yeah, she is an avid mechanical keyboard enthusiast. Welcome, welcome everyone. Uh, unfortunately, astro astrolo keys. There you go. Yeah, and she also is a very active member in the Seattle. Wait, you are you are local to Seattle, right? If you guys have been to the Seattle keyboard meetup, she has spoken there. I think last meetup she spoke there. She gave a talk. Yeah, go check her out. She started streaming recently that I found out. I unfortunately am not a badass programmer like her. I actually, I ditched the software engineering life to become a Twitch streamer, but welcome. I build a custom mechanical keyboards live on stream. This is the keyboard we're building today. It's called the Bauer. And it's in this very nice pink and kind of dark navy color scheme. We're building this up. 
and it's got my fingerprints everywhere because my fingers have touched some oil but we're gonna build this nice hopefully i'm guessing her your viewers are pretty familiar with mechanical keyboards at a minimum is that ring an engineering ring no i have i i think those are one of the pinky generally no I have had a couple friends who had those engineering rings. All right, let us test these stabs. Where are any daily questers? Wesley asked me to the daily quest. I still see Wesley doing the daily quest every time I stream. I know he's been wasting his points. Uh, shit. And enter. Hope your stream went well, Cass. Did you do some programming on stream today? <laughs> What's the difference between a Bauer and Norbauer? Oh no. <laughs> um, Bauer is the name of this model of keyboard from Dixie Mech. Norbauer is a designer in the community. Completely unrelated. <laughs> 10 points for the analog watch face? Yeah, I've been enjoying the analog watch face. I like it. That's a clean left shift right there. Nor Bauer Bauer. <laughs> Ooh, spacebar is clean too. What's up with all these similar lanes, like Teot types and A keyboards? I don't know, man. Ooh, enter sounds clean. All right. Nor Bauer versus Yes Bauer? Oh my goodness. <laughs> Alright, we are not going to be using these Gateron yellows. They were just for the purpose of uh, testing the stabilizers. Uh, you like singer David Bowie? Yeah. You guys realize I'm joking? Nice backtracking, doggy shot, shooty. <laughs> Teha, you look exactly like my uncle. Maybe I am your uncle. Who knows? I am technically an uncle to my nephew that I don't have. <laughs> Are you an uncle to me? <laughs> Have you got your hands on the Zenith to test it out? I don't think I am getting my hands on the Zenith. Toner does not like me. Same with Zombumon. I don't think they're sending one out to me. Uh, I did purchase one though. So just waiting for that to ship out. No wonder you make so many Adashi noises. <laughs> Nathan, Nathan, do you want a decent? I'm already gonna decline, Soran, because I know you're just baiting me. You are just baiting me today, Soran. What face is that on your Apple Watch? I don't know, I, forget. I think this is called the California face, actually. I think it might be called California. I'm asking for real, but not for the 65? All right. Do you guys think Soran is still baiting me? Or is he, is he being genuine? Do you have a recommendation for a soldering iron for just one build? For just one build, I would say don't even buy one. Just try to find a local maker space and rent out time there. 
or like if a community college near you lets you use their equipment, I don't know. LMAO store, I'm working on decent TKL name a bigger lie. <laughs> Uh, just press the watch face hard and it will show the name. Are you trolling me? Oh, wait, they're not. Yeah, I was right. It's called the California face. Can you lube switches with forehead grease? No. You're crazy? Why am I crazy? We just need to proto it? I'm down for decent TKL. I mean, you know me and TKLs. Are those inks lubed? Nope, these are completely unlubed. Sam Sheffer was in chat earlier? Yeah, I was talking to him earlier. He was here at the very beginning of the stream. I don't know if he's still here. Not a good crazy because you remembered your watch face name? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's still here. Hello. Sam, question. Do you still keep up with the whole uh, electronic skateboard bicycle industry? You were one of the few people I like trusted when it came to reviews for that. Dude, yes, I'm legit working on a review. Oh, no way. Um, I didn't end up going with the boosted. I did purchase an Evolve skateboard. This was years ago though. I don't know if you've heard of Evolve. I don't know if they're still around, but I heard boosted. I kind of want to purchase one once all this is over, but I heard boosted is not a great company anymore. Evolve Carbon GTR. Wait, that's what I had. Yeah. I went with it because the spec wise, it was more powerful than the boosted. Plus the all-terrain wheels. Ooh, I miss the all-terrain wheels. They're so fun. It's my new favorite board? Oh, I'm glad Evolve is still in business. Is it weird? I want to simp for your hands? Okay, Cass. <laughs> they didn't go bust, but they, uh, their higher up changed. And I heard the company is not so great anymore. But I, I've also been watching a ton of Potato Jet recently. And he got this electric, electric bicycle. That looks really fun as well. I kind of want to get into cycling. <laughs> it would be a bit safer than boarding around. Yeah, the Super 73, that's what it's called. Yeah, that one looks fun. Hey ha, I just uploaded a Van Move S3. Van Moof S3, I don't know what that is, unfortunately. I, I wasn't big into it. I just kind of did like enough research at the time. When, how long ago did I have the board? It must have been at least four years ago that I had that, no, not four, maybe, maybe three years ago that I had my Evolve. I ended up selling it just because I didn't ride it too much. I used to use it to commute and then I moved too far away from my work, so I just sold it. I don't know, if this pandemic is ever over, it'd be interesting to purchase again. Are you into cars? I do want to get into cars, but it's very expensive. <laughs> uh, I enjoy photographing and filming cars. I do have an interest in like car mods and whatnot, but I'm too poor to afford the hobby. Uh, this newest gen of Evolve Carbon GTR is insane. I'm about to ride up to Central Park from Tribeca for a good range. It's about 15 miles. Nice. Yeah. I mean, the, 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 I joined in on the first gen of Evolve boards. And I was pretty happy with the range, the battery life. But man, that all-terrain wheel, the all-terrain is so fun. So fun. And especially because I lived in the bay where the sidewalks are not very great. It was very convenient. I can just ro ride over uh, all the bumps and whatnot. I spent more on keyboards than car parts, I think. Oh, interesting. Gucci Dippin' Dots, things for the Prime. Rathanasar, things for the Tier 1 set. 
Wish we had more sidewalks where I'm at. I rarely have places to ride. Mm. Nathan, do you want to get into the plastic chair enthusiast scene? <laughs> the plastic chair enthusiast. <laughs> Trust me though, get into cars. Spent almost triple the amount I paid for my car on mods. The biggest reason why I don't want to get into cars is just how quickly it depreciates. Like all the hobbies I'm into currently, the depreciation is not that bad. Like custom knives, they hold their value pretty well. Uh, photography, videography gear, they depreciate pretty slowly. Keyboards are like appreciating. <laughs> Cars, they just, they depreciate the moment you buy it. Yo, what about Tia Tai's furniture design? I don't know enough about design or furniture to do either. <laughs> just don't be poor, Nathan, buy a Porsche. I uh, can't help that, unfortunately. <laughs> Zekin to your badge? Yeah, Zekin is an OG. I don't know if you guys are aware. I'm a big fan of Zek.works. Patiently waiting for my ogre. Also kind of sad Zekin didn't give me Sergi Founders Edition. Feels bad. What type of cars are you into? I can't really say I'm into cars. I'm a to I'm a complete noob. I just know, I just watch stuff, but I don't really, it doesn't really retain in my mind. Um, like I've seen my fair share of Doug the Mur the Doug the Muro on YouTube. I've seen car shows in the past. Uh, I don't really care for like crazy performance. I'm more of a, I mean, I do want performance, but I'm, I also want like comfort. Yeah, I mean, supercars are cool and all. And like having all that horsepower, okay, whatever. But like, I wanna be comfortable when I'm driving. <laughs> what car do you drive? I am currently leasing a Jetta. Are you going for European or Japanese? I don't even know what people go for nowadays. Do Camry, Toyota Camry 2008 seats defeat at comfort? <laughs> yes, I am leasing. I have a, I have a hookup with a man in LA who got me some pretty dank deals. Despite the Rona, car prices have gone up for purchasing and leasing currently. Kind of sucks. I totally expect a Teha and a Tesla. I would love a Tesla, but that's expensive. I... no. <laughs> uh, do you consider Sonoma County as part of the Bay Area? No. Well, I'm not a Bay Area native. I did live there for six years, but I don't consider Sonoma County as Bay Area. Bay Area for me stops. Mm. Yeah, definitely not Sonoma County. <laughs> Sonoma County is pretty up there. Marin, I would consider Marin part of the Bay Area. Marin's definitely nice though. It's, it is kind of secluded. Wherever bar lines stop. <laughs> Uh, it's uh, thanks for the tip. Uh, would you be re will you be releasing a switch loop tutorial? Yes, I will. Uh, it will give me some time, but I definitely will. Yes. Would you ever move to New York City? <sighs> I wouldn't mind living there for a couple years, but. I would only move out there if the opportunity presented. <laughs> like I need a lot of space and having to pay for that space in New York City. I mean, I guess I could live outside of New York City, but still expensive. 
rent prices are really low right now. Everyone is leaving New York City. New York, New York City is definitely not a place I don't, I, I see myself settling down in. But I think it'll be fun to live there for a couple of years. I've only visited it three times. I've had a lot of fun. The food there is great. Atmosphere is great, but I think after a couple of years, I'd get sick of it. How were you accommodating your need for a lot of space in the Bay Area? I wasn't. Uh, when I was in the Bay Area, it was getting pretty cramped. By the time I had decided to go full time, like my room was too small. Um, I pretty much took over the living room <laughs> of my apartment complex, which I shared with two other roommates. So it was like spilling into the living room. I've lived here for seven years. It's a great city, but different now because of Corona. Mm. Man, seven years, that sounds like a long time to be in New York. Why 9999 so you don't want to give it away? Yes, that is that is the reasoning behind it. All right, we've completed inserting the switches. Let us get to the soldering. Would you ever move to Seattle? Maybe. I don't really have friends up in Seattle though. I've been to Seattle once. I can't say I really explored it. I didn't get the chance to. So I'm not quite sure what Seattle is like. Would you ever leave the United States? Oh, <laughs> leave the United States? That's, no. If I left the United States, my business expenses would go through the roof. Keyboard parts being shipped to anywhere than the US, pretty expensive. <laughs> uh, where is my solder? NFT switches recommend. Yeah, look at poor AIO3. <laughs> uh, come to Toronto. I do want to visit Canada. Canada looks like the place to be. All the, like the, the YouTube scene is also growing in Canada. I feel like a lot of the, the rising kind of tech tuber video slash like photography oriented YouTubers, they're all coming out of Canada for some reason. I don't know, has, has the US become too saturated? Dave to D is a Turan, how do you even pronounce the Torontonian? <laughs> Canada is where it's at, especially Vancouver and Toronto. Hmm. Linus is Canadian. Um, Alex Otos is also, yeah, Canadian. Uh, Becky and Chris, they're a YouTube channel that I really like. They're also based in Canada. Peter McKinnon, Canada. Maddie, Canada. Um, that whole like group of like photography oriented YouTubers that I really like. They're all based up there for some reason. <laughs> Come to Germany, we have GMK and Cherry. All right, Cherry, currently a joke. I don't think Cherry is a compelling enough reason for me to move to the Germany. GMK, uh, maybe, but I don't need more GMK sets. Yeah. Agree. Becky and Chris are fantastic. I love their video. I love their aesthetic. And they're so cute. I love that they, like, they make videos together. My biggest question for Becky and Chris is how the hell do they have time? <laughs> Chris is like some top not, he's like a radiologist or neurosurgeon or something. He's like, Chris is insane. And he's such a handyman. Like how does he have time to fly a helicopter, do all his F, FPV stuff. They like know how to woodwork. Like what? <laughs> how does he have time for all that? I don't understand. They're insane. Like in a good way. But yeah, I love their channel. Money? No, it's not even money, it's just time. I mean, Chris is a rate, he's, he's a neurosurgeon or something. So I, I get the money part. But the time is what I'm talking about. 
Make time? Chris is a chat? Chris is a, he's a big chat. I would go cap pride for Chris. Chris is a dank catch. Uh, oh right, Chris Howe and his, um, his like production stuff. They're also Canadian, I believe. A lot of Canadian YouTubers. He's interventional radiologist. I have no idea what that means, but it sounds intense. All right, let me solder some anchor points and then we'll get to our sponsor time. Make time, how can you ever have time if you don't make time? It's so hard to make time though, men's and nurse. So hard. Chris and who, uh, their YouTube channel is Becky and Chris. B-E-C-K-I and Chris, K, or sorry, C-H-R-I-S. Start a keyboard house with Alex Zotos. I don't think a keyboard content streamer house is lucrative at all. <laughs> Not lucrative, I'm gonna say. Move to San Diego? San Diego is expensive too. San Diego is a nice city though. I would not mind retiring in San Diego. The food there is amazing. You're right by a very nice beach. It's not polluted like the ones in LA. Overall chill vibe. I like San Diego. I only want to see you make keyboards. <laughs> okay, Cass. Also, Cass, I didn't realize you help out uh, Jun Lee. I love Jun Lee. He's so funny. I was watching my Instagram stories. I think it was yesterday or today. And he retweeted Cass. And I was like, what the heck? Cass is a, he's a high key celebrity too. He just doesn't stream. I just got a partner. Yeah, I saw. OP man, OP. Move to Chicago. I heard Chicago, I've heard mixed reviews of Chicago. Some people enjoy it, some people don't like Chicago. I've also never been to Chicago, so can't really say. Uh, yo, Chortle, I'm gonna still call you Chortle. Thank you so much for the tier three sub. How you doing? I'm doing pretty good. Today is an extra stream, but pretty chill stream today. How are you doing, Chortle? Uh, Emmanuel, thanks so much for the tip. What tactile switches do you recommend? I have a command, exclamation, best tactiles. Where I list some of my favorite tactile switches. All right, it is now time for sponsor time. We have a couple sponsors of Tia Types. The first sponsor that we have is Dixie Mac. Head on over to DixieMac.com slash Tia Types. GMK Minimal Round 2 has been graciously extended for one extra day. So if you guys forgot to purchase GMK Minimal Round 2, today is the absolute last day to pick it up. It's a great uh, white and black color scheme keycap set. I will probably be giving away a couple more of those after this stream. So if you guys want to stick around until then, I'll be giving some away. I have a discount code with Dixie Mech as well using code sweet tay at checkout. Saves you 5% off in stock items. These switches we're using today, they will go live on Dixie's website on September 6th. And these keyboard cases that we saw earlier also will be in stock at a later date. Next we have KBD fans. Head on over to kbdfans.com. They are the place that I recommend a lot of beginners and people starting off in the hobby to start just because they generally have the most items in stock as well as uh, them being pretty affordable relative to the hobby, but still providing a nice quality for the price you pay. Check out kbdfans.com. I forgot yesterday, managed to get my set. Yo, nice. 
Next we have Keycult, who raided us earlier during this stream. They make fantastic high-end luxury mechanical keyboards that I am a huge fan of. They do stream on Twitch as well. Uh, they have a great social presence. They interact with their customers. They're pretty active on their Discord as well. Check out keycult.com. Next, we have Novel Keys. Head on over to novelkeys.xyz. GMK Sloth running tomorrow. It's going live tomorrow. If you guys are in the market for a sloth themed keycap set, check out GMK Sloth. Uh, Novel Keys also carries tons of switch options, uh, random keyboard knickknacks, keyboard merch desk mats. I have a discount code with Novel Keys using code. Teha Keys at checkout saves you 5% off in stock items. I just realized you have the future Pirate King as your mod. <laughs> yeah, that's my that's one of my bot accounts. <laughs> I named my bots Teha Teha Chopper and Teha D Luffy. Uh, next we have Prime Keyboards. Head on over to primekb.com slash Teha Types. You can purchase desk keys films currently. Uh, Alpaca is still not restocked. T1s you can purchase still, I believe. Check out primekb.com slash types. And if you guys haven't seen their interest check for an upcoming keyboard they're gonna have, be sure to check it out on Geekac. It's a pretty neat little board. I'm excited for it. Next, we have Switch Mod. Head on over to switchmod.net slash types. GMK Beta currently live. Using code TT at checkout saves you $4 off your purchase. I will be joining in on the GMK Beta JS base kit. Looks so nice. Highly recommend you guys check out GMK Beta. And we will have a slip line to build pretty soon not for me for someone else but i don't know if you guys joined in on the slip line if anyone wanted slip line coming up uh, why are you not sponsored by apex or Heine? i currently am not taking more sponsors i already have way too many sponsors i have dropped sponsors this year um, as much as i would like more sponsors I think it's just a little too much if your list is very long. <laughs> and last but not least, we have ZOPC. Head on over to zopc.net slash types. They are a Canadian vendor. We talked about Canada this stream. Uh, they've got some very nice smooth linears called Telios. They've got smooth silent linears. They've got smooth tactiles, smooth silent tactiles. Check out zopc.net slash tab types. Drop, drop. Speaking of Heine, get him as a co-host for your podcast. Maybe, maybe. I don't know. I do have reservations about having a vendor or designer as a co-host. That can be that can be a little bit. That's entering the gray area a bit. Like, yeah, I'm pretty close to a lot of the vendors and designers. But to, to the outside eye, I feel like the community would be okay with it. But to like the uninformed, it can be kind of WTF or a little sus. A little sus. Lil Nathan says something, Soran just says no. <laughs> Okay. Oh, I missed, wait, I missed so many switches. What the heck? How did I miss this entire half of a row here? Isn't gray the best color though? <laughs> I do like gray. Oh, also, 
to um to any vendors that are that might be tuning in or aspiring vendors or designers that aren't sponsoring me i've had two vendors reach out to me asking if i had emailed them under a certain account that is not me supposedly someone is trying to pose as me to get free stuff for review that's not me <laughs> any email from me will be coming from the teatypes.com domain yeah <laughs> i don't know if that person watches me but it's not me <laughs> there you go any if an email does not come from teatypes something at teatypes.com it is not related to me for future reference okay it. Imagine impersonating a 46 year old man. Okay, bud. All right. Um, I mean, this plate is fixed. I don't even really need to check for straightness. <laughs> I've been found out. Let's see. We skipped any switches. Hi, how type strikes again? Okay. Bring up via. Oh, I just skipped the entire home. What the heck just happened? What? Hmm? Did Via just close on itself? What happened? What? Okay. Wait, it just minimized all my windows. Wait a minute, what? Ah, I missed the switch. Dang it. F key? Yes, this is the function key. No, 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 I, I forgot to solder. <laughs> I swear I've done this for a while. But I still miss some switches sometimes. I use Mac caps lock may need to be changed for a use case. Yeah, I think it's just I spammed too much. You always miss? Okay, buddy. Kind of toxic. Professional build service, by the way. <laughs> nice. All right. I'm going to change Dixie's original layout. Split backspace. Uh, left. Whoa, what the heck? Imagine putting Windows as caps lock. Mac users, SMH, left control, left window, left alt, looks good. Left shift, left control, tab, backspace. All right, this looks good to me now. We can assemble this now. I'm gonna clean up, we'll assemble this, and that'll be today's keyboard content. What firmware is this? 1.3.1. Which I believe is the latest. I'm gonna go wash my hands. BRB chat. Wait, is music not playing? No music is playing.
We back. No, not we back. <laughs> Did you see Dave to these new video? He leaked something big. Uh, how recent? If you're talking about me making him a keyboard, yes, I did see it. I can't get enough of this music. Glad you enjoy the music. Why is my internet so laggy? Are you surprised by what? Oh. Okay, let us assemble this. I don't need any of this. When will Dave to these build be? I will announce it when it is ready. I do have most, I have all of the parts. I'm just in the process of lubing his switches. Did you know you were making him a board? Yes. <laughs> It would have been weird if Dave just name dropped me, but wasn't <laughs> when I wasn't actually working with him. No, it's been in the works for a couple of months. <laughs> that would have been a pretty dick move by Dave, I would say. <laughs> Wait, Mr. Dixie, I don't have screws. I also remembered this gets mounted upside down. I think this uses M2, right? I can just use M2. This should work. Mmm, perfect. This is why he sent me these scuffed stabs. So I can harvest the screws. Check the bag you threw all over the place. <laughs> Alright. Okay. GG, I think Dick I think Dixie's mad for throwing his keyboard around. No, there were no screws in here to begin with. I'm pretty sure I did not see any screws or bags of screws. I will check the rest of it. I think Dixie sent me screws. But it's okay, we have a solution. <laughs> Wait, I'm, I'm not done yet stress testing this bag, Dixie. I haven't even thrown it at max height. Are you nervous? Stay at throws? It's not often I get to stress out a sponsor like this. How to get the most content out of this. <laughs> How do you download VIA? If you type in exclamation VIA, it takes you to the link to download it. Okay, that's in there pretty securely now. Uh, I will have the cable running that way. <laughs> Have you always lived in SoCal? Yes. And then this goes on top, like so. Just remember, this board is like one of 12 Vickery units. Wait, this is going to get Vickery auctioned? You didn't tell me that before I threw this around. <laughs> this is going to get Vickery auctioned? Well, someone's about to pay some Vickery auction prices for a scuffed keyboard. <laughs> How much did it cost all to make? This case, I believe, I believe it retailed for like what, 450? 
It's been a while since this ran, I'm not too sure. It was in the 400s, I believe. Uh, the switches will, they haven't retailed yet, but they will be retailing at 75 cents per switch. There are around 70 switches or so in this build, so you do the math. Keycaps, keycaps retailed for, what did GMK800 retail for? I'm gonna guess like one, one, 120, 130 for the base kit. 450 for MSRP, Victory Auction was 1500, right. All right, the Victory Auction happened. What am I saying? This isn't a Victory Auction unit. I can throw this around. This is just going back to Dixie. I can just, I can kick this. I can do whatever I want. M Broadkey, thanks for the Prime. Pastel, thanks for the Prime. Ken Paula, thanks for the five months. I recognize your username. Chris says your name so many times. <laughs> Bowl Cut Gamer, thanks for the two months. Can you suggest any budget friendly tactiles? Budget friendly tactiles. Uh, what's considered a budget friendly tactile? If you get just regular Halo Clears, Halo Trues, I think those are pretty decent tactiles. Oh, T1 switches, right? T1 switches from um, primekb.com slash stat types. All pretty nice. Black Missile, thank you. Missile, thank you so much for the Prime sub. Bloody Stains, thank you for the tier one sub. Let me make sure. Uh, I do still need to check for straightness, I believe. Is there a competitive keyboard scene? I will play <laughs> what? I don't know how you would... What is there to be competitive about? On a keyboard scene? <laughs> keyboard screen. Uh, Anonymous, thank you so much for gifting a sub to Lucia Amis. Bunyan Win, thank you so much for five months. Have a good day, thank you. Hope you have one too. I'm a pro Razer keyboarder. Oh my goodness. Competitive about how much money you spend? I guess that might be a thing, sure. Most keyboards owned? That's not even a competition though. Oh, actually most keyboards owned? Mm. There might be competition, but I mean, that's not really something that would have recurring value. Probably belongs to Hata? Yeah, most likely. Next snack, I think it's for the two months. Okay, box eight in five minutes. Oh God. <laughs> that is a competition, sure. <laughs> Most GMK boxes beaten in five minutes. But then it'd be over if like Matt Stoney enters or Joey Chestnut. <laughs> and it's like, GG, <laughs> why even hold the competition anymore? <laughs> Alright, 
no longer scraping. Olivia++ plus plus delivers today? Feels bad, I still don't have any tracking update from Novel Keys. Chubby bunny except with keycaps? <laughs> I guess that's a thing too. <laughs> You probably ordered too many kits. Chubby bunny with keycaps, that's an idea. Yo Shin, thanks for the tier one sub. Brian Bradaloff, thanks for the tier one prime. Snack snack, thanks for the two months. You gotta put GMK8008 on this, right? Do you guys actually want a different keycap set other than 8008? I'm assuming you're going to put 8008. Yes, that is what I intend to put on. Has to be 8008? Alright, I'll go grab it. going to have to yoink it from my square keyboard. Oh, my desk looks so messy right now. Hold on, let me, let me move some of all this. It's a little bit nicer. Is this the new Novel Keys NK69 board? Oh, are we going to see an 8008 colorway on the NK69? A collab between two keyboard vendors? I'm a fan of this box. Box is pretty nice, yeah. Do we use this artisan, yes or no? Swirls? I didn't purchase the swirls. I generally don't purchase the Rama novelty keycaps. I do not own the swirls, unfortunately. What are the switches on the other board? These are N1 Gaterons, which you can purchase off KBD fans. Use the Dixie X. I think I have a Dixie X. Q W E R T Y. 
Sorry, I'm watching from work. No worries. Are the eight zeros or eight, eight inks loop? These are completely stuck. Those inks look pretty nice. Yeah. I mean, we've already built the Bower with inks plenty of times on this stream, so I didn't feel like I really needed to lube these. Um, if you guys do want to hear what the Bower sounds like with Gateron inks, there is a typing test on my channel. Uh, the build VOD is still up on my main channel as well. So I thought, why not try building with a stock switch for a change? Any leaf issues with these recolor ones? I have been told these are from the new V2 molds. So hopefully there shouldn't be any leaf issues. What switches are in the board? These are N1 Gaterons, Clavier from KBD fans. You would think Dixie would want loop switches though. No, what if Dixie likes it dry? You don't know that. You can't assume Dixie's preference for raw versus lubed. <laughs> Who is Dixie? Dixie is the owner of Dixie Mech, one of my sponsors. They're a they're one of the rising boutique keyboard, custom keyboard part vendors. Liquids more. Thank you so much for the bits. Whoa, Cheongyi, thank you so much for the 10 months. Long time no see. Long, low Ken M. Thanks for the two months as well. He is the top US. Dixie just got hooed. Feels bad. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> oh my goodness, Mike. Thank you so much for the 10 gift to sub. Mike. Do you, would you consider running a GMK set right now? I'm giving away, I'm purchasing GMK sets for some people on stream today. But you don't have any keycap set that's live. GMK sloth starts tomorrow. What is your favorite keyboard to do? Do you have a good recommendation for a beginner like me? Sorry, I have to go. No worries. NK who? <laughs> Chat, what's the switches? These switches are N1 Gaterons. You can purchase them on KBD fans. These are the upcoming 8008 inks that have not been live yet, but they will go live on Dixie Max website in three days on September 6th. They will be live for 75 cents a switch. Sloth and Monokai, yeah, they start tomorrow. That's the thing. <laughs> uh, I'm just heading to bed now though. Have a great rest of your team. All right, have a good one, Jengi. Hope you have a good night. Giveaway Monokai? I guess I could leave it up to the client. I mean, winner. If they want to hold off on me purchasing a set for them till tomorrow. I guess that's a thing. Uh, okay, I don't need any of these sets anymore. Also, if you want to give away Olivia++ Plus Plus sets, let me know. Let's do that for the subathon. Subathon. How about that? Thank you, though. Thank you. Wow, we got more, more giveaways for subathon. Oh god, I need to find the keycaps I need now. Uh. Crap. 
Are those real windows in the back? Yes, they are real windows. I just have them covered somewhat. Why are you, I know, I realize, I realize. I just pulled it from here. Rela relax. I'm, I'm trying to find the key cap for it. Ooh, wait, I'm kind of digging this Dixie X here. Oh! keys why are they so hard to find <sighs> why did you just put the split backspace Did I? Oh. <laughs> I, oh, I put it in here. I was wondering if there's a alpha colored one. I guess not. The old age man. I am getting old. Keyboard building is too hard now. I want to retire. All right, page up, page down. Uh, delete. I still don't have the arrow keys. Where are the rest of the arrows? What? Oh, there's one here. Oh, right here. <laughs> Page down. Page up. Love the strings. Ah, we did it. We did it. Boomer cataracts? Dude, it's so hard to find keycap. Pink arrows are busts? I don't know if I have pink arrows. I don't think I... Oh, pink arrows are here. Nah. I don't want to open it. We'll just remove all the switches in this keyboard too. TBH. And <sighs> Brocky, thanks for the tip. Uh, what's your opinion on the cat profile and what's it like to type on? Cat profile, I prefer much over. Um, SA profile. I do prefer MT3 over cat. Um, it's a cat's on the taller side. What's it like to type on? It's a little bit tall for me. Um, I would like there to be more sculptage to it. Some people like cat. Uh, it sounds it sounds decent. I think I do prefer the sound of cat over SA as well. I'm Cuban B. Thank you so much for the tier one sub. Deep fried one. Thank you for the prime. Sign the signature of the bits. Uh, what is your favorite keyboard loop? Crytox Tofu I've created zero. I think I'm caught up. All right. Please fix arrows. No, I'm gonna stick with this. Let's 
see if I can wipe some of it down. Let me buy that accent can off you? No. Accent arrows and enter on 65 is a no-no. Don't want a diving board. <laughs> All right. This is the 8008. Entirely themed. Bow okay, I didn't wipe there, Cabell. Bauer. 8008 Bauer with the pink and navy. 8008 key, uh, switches, pink plate, and the 8008 keycaps. Yummy. All right, let's take a screenshot of this. Can we get the words per minute bot started mods? Will there be 8008 round two this year? I doubt it. Hmm. I like the way Bauer looks from the front. You can't really see the... I guess like this. Three, two, one, boom. Place your bets. Place your bets, chat. While I prepare the typing test. We can change this to... 8008 color scheme. Ooh. Grits and gravy. Things for the 100 bits. The electric Kool Aid. Things for the three months. Dang, I haven't had grits in so long. I could eat some good southern food right now. I have no faith. Talks. You're right, all this dirty. Is the bot still alive? This bot is lasting a while. Faith has no faith. <laughs> you know what we call southern food over here, Nathan? What, just regular food? Is that a Fontaine sticker on the bottle? Yes, I collect Fontaines. Or keep, I collect cards in general. The bot is still alive. Or did it end? I'm gonna guess it ended. It's been quite a while. <sighs> Mic in your face? Yes, there's nothing I can do about that. I have to point it at the uh, keyboard. All right, here we go. This is gonna be the typing test with the 8008 inks. These are completely unlubed, so keep that in mind. It's obviously not going to sound as great as lube switches, but the Bauer still has a pretty nice sounding board in my opinion. I like the acoustics. Here we go.
127, my goodness. Feels bad. <laughs> the space bar sounds so good though for a stock switch. These are what the mods sound like. Yeah, I would say they sound similar. They sound more like inks than they do uh, Gateron yellows. I do like the spring. The spring does have that kind of, I mean, it's the same spring as a Gateron yellow, essentially. And now it's time to desolder, lube them and rebuild. Okay, Dixie. <laughs> yeah, I do like the spring. Gateron yellow spring is very popular. It's got like a, I don't know, I, I feel like slow springs to me, they, they kind of have a supple bottom out because that change in weight between the actuation and bottom out is so small. There's something supple about it when you, when you bottom out. It's a very, it's a comfortable bottom out. But it does, it's, not, it's not like a mushy bottom out. It's just a, you feel something different. But you obviously have to be trained to notice the difference. It is nice, yeah. Does Taya get to keep this board? Nope, I'm returning this back to Dixie Mac. Okay, one more. One sub 130 is feels bad. Bauer round two, and this is, I'm actually not sure. I feel like this, I don't recall the Bauer one having the internals of this. I'm gonna say this is an in-between prototype, but this is not the Bauer two. I know for sure it's not the Bauer two. Sounds pretty good for box. These aren't box switches though. <laughs> yeah, I mean, this would definitely sound nicer once it's lubed. I also really liked the palm plate on the Bauer. Uh, I, I believe the first ever Bauer prototype I built, it was V2, not V, it was GAT inks that were lubed and it was on a palm plate. Sounds really nice. Go take a listen to it on my YouTube channel. What do you think is your fastest with over 98% accuracy? I'm not too sure, never tried. <laughs> uh, how do you compare JWK versus inks sound wise and smoothness? JWK blows inks out of the water for smoothness currently. Sound wise, uh, hard to see. I've never done a scientific comparison. I do think inks when they are lubed sound pretty nice. That's an OG Bauer. Okay, there you go. This is an OG Bauer. What bit rate are you streaming with? 6,000, I believe is what I have it set to. My OBS says it's currently at 63, 69, 62, 24, 6303. I stream at 6,000. Uh, smoothness, yeah, I mean, these are pretty smooth. I would, I will say JWK 
JWK is still smoother, but these are really good. I I don't think inks are a switch you really can complain about smoothness. They're pretty smooth. I mean, lube does help them a little bit, but inks for me, they're more than smooth enough, in my opinion. If you lube it, it sounds a lot better. It feels a lot better too. Do you need to lube inks? I would say so. You should definitely lube inks. Uh, inks sound very nice once they're lubed. Why does is the name Bauer? Bauer means builder in German. Dixie liked it. <laughs> I don't know. Can you press the power button on the PlayStation 1 desk? What, which one's the play? I never owned the PlayStation. Is this the power button? Boop, 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 boop. All right. Bite Orca. Thank you so much for the Prime. Sasu, Sasus. Thank you so much for the Prime. Let me bring the music back. All right. If you guys liked these switches, then September 6th, that's when you guys want to check out dixiemech.com slash types to pick these up. I like, I definitely like these switches. I mean, I don't, I don't care too much for the colorway, honestly, but I think the smoothness of these, very nice. More than enough for me. Jack Bauer is a fictional character in the lead protagonist of 24, also that too, yes. What lamp do you have in the back? That lamp is from Ikea. That's from Ikea. What are the best JWK linears right now? Literally all of them. <laughs> They're all pretty much the same. I don't think you're gonna go wrong picking one over the other. Just get one that you like the color of. Is it time to give away more sets? More sets chat. Who wants giveaways? All right, do we give away? Let's give away a set of GMK beta since this live right now. Switchmod.net slash tan types. Okay, if you guys don't know what GMK beta looks like, uh, this isn't gonna leak anything, right? Yes. This is GMK Beta, currently live on switchmod.net slash types. There is the base kit and there is the JS kit. I personally think the JS kit looks nicer than the base kit, but up to you guys. They cost the same. So we're gonna give away one of these, all right? And the key word for this is going to be, ah, oh. Oh, that's so slow. I am a beta. I will pick a winner at 345. 345, one person will win this. It is open world. Well, it's not technically open worldwide. If you are an international viewer, I might just PayPal you the cash equivalent. Or maybe I'll just buy it. I guess I can purchase it through the, the respective proxy. I guess that works. Yeah. Keyword is I am a beta. You guys are just admitting to being beta individuals just to win a keycap set. I can clean up now while this happens. shoulder this is ridiculous I have to guess every time <laughs> you gonna lose thank you so much for the nine months drip thanks so much for the prime Christian STZ thanks for the prime 
throw away these old stabs that Dixie sent. Three more minutes. Three, thanks for doing the build. Thank you, Dixie, for letting me build. Wait, what the heck? Oh my goodness, Dixie doing 20 subs. Holy crap, thank you so much, Dixie. Wait, 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 Dixie, don't leave yet. We're not done yet. 20 gift of subs. This has to undergo the final. The final stress test. The final stress test. Wait, Bauer's in here. Let me just verify. Bauer, where is it? The hell? Oh gosh, I thought you forgot. There's the Bauer. No trickery. No live editing. It is in there. All right. <laughs> oh, my foot hurts. One more? Other foot. Hundred percent safe. I can now one hundred percent recommend. This is my review of the Mecha Keyboard keyboard case. Your keyboard unscathed, hopefully. No dent. Not a single scratch. Just my finger oils from touching lube. Pristine. All right, PCB is cracked. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> All right. You can now rest assured this keyboard will be safe. But will it blend? No, it will not. All right. It is now 345. I will draw a winner in three, two, one. Surprise adoption. Do you claim the set of GMK beta? Billy Sachs, thank you so much for the bits. Mr. Petrov, oh my goodness. Thank you so much for the 17 months. Welcome back. Where is my wedding invitation? I'm not, I'm not getting married yet. Every time my products go to a content creator, they try to destroy them. Okay, this one was legitimate. Come on. Uh, Johnny G, things with the one of this. Roll Dankle, things with the Prime. The Wild Winston with the Prime. Timoth Arg with the Prime. Mr. Hanks, things with the 15 months. All right, this man claims it. Uh, please DM me your shipping information on either Twitch, Discord, Instagram. Please do let me know. Let me write this down. But we're not done yet. We still have more things to give away surprise adoption gmk beta all right i've also been wondering should we just like drop by a random stream and gift them subs or should we just only give away keyboard products how generous is chat feeling do you guys just want all the money to yourselves or should we just drop by and drop some gifted subs on a random stream. Not generous, all the money to us. Keyboard? Okay, I don't need to take a vote. 
We're gonna take a vote. Should we cut our fund in half to just drop subs on a random stream? Yes or no? I was <laughs> leaning towards the nose. <laughs> It would be a small time creator. Wait, what does Sorian say? Unless that stream is mine? Okay, buddy. How do you vote? You type in chat. The selfish keyboard community. All right, looks like chat doesn't want it all for themselves. I can either give away two more keycap sets or drop. $250 dono on a random stream. You guys sure? <laughs> or I can do one more keycap set and drop a $125 dono on other stream. <laughs> I can't I can't parse this. <laughs> I like that idea. Wait, which idea, Cass? <laughs> Where's my water? Where's my water? Charity? Well, it's not really charity. I would still get taxed for this. I just, I'll just take the hit. Don't know to Pudzi? No. No way. Half, half? All right, we'll do one more keycap set. And then we'll do, we'll just drop some gifted subs on a random stream. Um. What keycap set should we give away? We, we I'll give away one more keycap set. Don't know June? Wait, is June live right now? I actually don't know his Twitch channel, Cass. GMK Mizu? GMK Mizu's not live. Sloth isn't live. Should I just give them the confirmation I'll purchase it? Dolch round five? Dolch round five is live. How much is Dolch round five? Oh, thank you also for the level four hype train chat. I could, I'm okay with Dolch round five. Should we do that? Uh, is this website gonna leak? No, no address leaked. Okay, let's do that. Support our mod lightning keyboards. Today, no, tomorrow. Tomorrow is the last day to purchase this amazing looking set. Dolch round five, all right? Uh, what should the keyword for this be? I miss Miago. <laughs> That's what this is. I miss Miago. <laughs> Sorry, I missed Miago 11. You gotta add the 11. I will pick a winner at 355. 355, I'll pick a lucky winner. One person will win this set. Uh, some Texan, thank you so much for the tier one sub. Cast, thank you so much for the bits. Eat my rice, thank you so much for the bits. Vizus, thank you so much for the bits. Keurig Homebrew, thank you so much for the prime. Exo Homes with the prime. The old Crow TV with the prime. Bad example with the four months. Jatan, thank you so much for the prime as well. Music is playing, right? Hopefully it's playing. Yeah, it's playing, I see it. Okay, I'll clean up some more. Oh, I forgot to mention another thing. Uh, for the upcoming subathon, tentatively next Friday, it will be dedicated 
to my mod team. Half of the earnings of next week's subathon will be going towards the first ever paycheck given by Teatypes to the mod team. So it will be appreciated if you guys participate next week. But yeah, half of next week's subathon earnings go to the mods. My mods take quite a quite a hit to their mental health managing the degenerates that is Twitch chat and Discord questions and help channel. <laughs> so hopefully this compensates them in some way. After two and a half years of streaming, these mods finally get some form of compensation. <laughs> I do, I do appreciate my mods. They, uh, they go through quite a lot. And they are all unpaid. And I've, I've been meaning to do a, like a mod dedicated stream for a while, but this is the one to do now. Does this include previous mods? Ooh. I don't know if the current mod team would enjoy having their paycheck being distributed amongst more people. <laughs> Two more minutes. Can I become a mod now? No. Yeah, if you guys do watch Twitch, don't give the moderators a harder time, whether it's my channel or other channels. They're, they're all unpaid. I don't think even like the top mods for, or maybe the top mods for like the top streamers get paid, but the majority of mods, they are unpaid positions. Unpaid janitors, yeah. September Snow, thanks for the Prime, as Chocolatine, thanks for the eight months. Gym Leader, Nathan, thanks for the three months. Cast, thanks for the bits again. Nathan, thanks for the 13 months. Yeah. What is this for again? I will be giving, a, I'll, I'll be purchasing a set of GMK Dolch round five for one random winner in chat. This base kit only, you will have to purchase the extension, the hunger kit if you want, extension, the raw cherry. Did I purchase the raw cherry? Raw cherry looking kind of dank too. I don't know if I purchased this. I definitely purchased hunger extension base. I'll have to check. Oh, it's 45 bucks. It is now 3.55. And the lucky winner of this final GMK set is going to be... Oh, Barnoom Beer. Wait, Barnoom Beer is an OG. I know him. I think he's a founder too. He's been a follower since September 22nd of 2018. I started streaming July of 2018. Oh, he's here. He claims. Wow, it didn't go to a bot for once. Congrats, Mr. Barnumbeer. Being a founder finally paid off. Barnumbeer. Let me, uh, DM me your information and I'll get a set up or I'll purchase one. One thing to keep in mind, all of you guys who won, all of these sets, they're not shipping out until next year, okay? <laughs> so don't, don't bug me. When's it going to ship? They're not shipping until next year, all right? <laughs> not shipping until next year. Just pretend like you won something nice and then just erase it from your mind. And then just expect a pleasant, just be surprised when you receive this random gift one day. When is it shipping? The expected ship date is July, 2021. <laughs> so about a year from now, 10 months from now, is the, that's the expected ship date. Assuming like the color needs to be better matched or there's like shipping delays yeah, It's gonna be more than a year. Assuming that happens. Yeah, if society exists by then true Maybe Corona would have just wiped out all of us And keyboards meant nothing and we just spent the last couple of months Getting flipped on paying thousands of dollars for keyboard products Only to succumb to the Rona <laughs> All right, uh, the last 
$125, we will just donate. Should we just donate it as a PayPal or just gift it as subs? What should we do, chat? PayPal? Subs? Okay, I can't do this. Vote yes for PayPal, no for subs. Yes, PayPal, no 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 subs. <sighs> I lean to the PayPal. I feel like subs are more fun, but it is true. You would, the streamer gets more off PayPal than subs. <sighs> All right, what category should we go? Should we gift it to? Like someone with no viewers or someone that I know. Subs are more fun, but the, the streamer makes more off bits. What is yes? <laughs> no viewers? Apiary is live? I could do Apiary. I could, I could split the 125 into like two donations, let's say, but I feel like a giant 125 is better than two smaller donos no what do you guys think someone with low viewers all right which category though is the question let me is this gonna leak anything no it will not which category just chatting makers and crafting 50 viewer max i think we should go lower maybe we should go to like a 20 viewer or less 20 or less how about that just chatting makers and crafting valorant Makers and crafting? All right, let's go help our fellow creatives. Oh, hey, it's me. Wait, I thought... Dude, 50 doesn't even matter. It's me, Apiary, and then 26. Oh my goodness. We need more creatives on Twitch. There is no one with 50 viewers. All right, we need sub 20, which starts for, Wait, what? what is this ordering? Hmm. Do any of these ring out to you, chat? Ooh, Pokeball Terrariums. What the heck? Find someone making Gundam? Ooh, new product prototyping. Wait, this man is prototyping. Do we help someone's prototypes? Wait, this kind of looks like Salvin's. No, I'm just kidding. Hmm, Gundams? Who's doing Gundams? The one guy, this one guy lubing yellows, who's loving? Oh, who this? Fern Nand. No information. Do we do this guy or what? Fernand is an option. <laughs> Bad words only stream, what the heck? Uh, resin flowers and charms? Hmm. Budget Teha lubing kiwis? What the heck, PP man, fifteen. What the heck? Here for a good time, not a long time. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Zach Keys. Who's this guy? KBD eight X Mark two with Zelios. Oh. Got a lot of options. Wait, so there's a lot of keyboard folks on here. Wait, there's another one. Abriendo paquetes y lubiando. Oh, lubiando. Is that how you say lube in Spanish? All right. I don't think I will understand his stream. I would like to understand their reaction. Wait, this is it. There's no scrolling for the makers and crafting categories. This is literally it for makers and crafting. Uh, wait, there's one here too, Spacey. 
Modding a SK61. Client build. Build client. Hmm. This is how little makers and crafting streamers there are. <laughs> <coughs> Feels bad. Imagine not picking Apiary. I mean, I would like to give it to a friend, but I feel like Apiary doesn't need it, you know? Do we go for budget Teha? You guys really want budget Teha? Top, top, the top left guy with the white shirt. Okay, buddy. <laughs> or, this is hard. Budget tail. <laughs> feeling this guy he's prototyping something what is a cinema and bayer design i mean this guy looks kind of cool how does this guy feel no you guys really want budget teha close your eyes and move the mouse <sighs> all right i'll do that Where's my mouse? Oh, my mouse isn't even on the screen. <laughs> ah. It's still not on the screen. I can't do this. This is too hard. Hmm. Hmm. What if this guy's watching my stream though? And then he's trying to bait me. Face reveal at 200 followers. Wait, it's not even 200 followers and this guy revealed already. Okay, this... <laughs> scam? It might be scam. Hmm. Hmm. Let's do... Ah, but this guy doesn't have a face cam. Wait, Gundam! This guy's doing Gundam. Okay, but he's way too gamer. I don't want to donate to a guy like this. This is too much gamer. <laughs> Should we just do the eight, the the prototype guy? Way to gamer. <laughs> Let's do. I think let's do prototype guy. We will help his help alleviate some of his prototyping funds. How about that? All right. Wait, how do I donate? Ah, I can't donate. I'll just give subs. I'll give subs. I'll give subs. All right, tune in to his stream. I'm gonna change scenes for a bit, so I don't. I don't know if this leaks anything. Uh, let's gift him. How do I gift? Oh, they changed the UI. Okay, gift. Hundred twenty-five. That's what twenty-five subs. I'm gonna click it. I don't know if you guys are tuning in, but I'm gonna click it. Clicked. Complete purchase. All right, I completed purchase. Wait, I can't, I can't hear his reaction, GG. What, what? What's this guy saying? What even? 
Oh no, the music is too loud. Guys, I wasn't even looking. I wasn't, I wasn't even looking. I was, oh man, what even is going on? I have to scroll way up. Oh my gosh. How's it going? Thank you so much. I can't even. Hey, he sounds like I a can't nice even guy. See what's going on because my notifications tab is just spamming way too hard. All right, I feel like this was a good candidate. Wait, <laughs> he suddenly has two hundred twenty-three oh viewers. Gosh. Holy crap! Wait, we're not we're not rating Dude, him, guys. How is it? Going? Wait, wait, do you want to rate him? Do you guys want to rate him? Dude, I was gonna rate Apiary or someone else, but cinema. I guess we can rate him too. He you seems a, like a pretty a nice guy. Little... All right, we'll give this him the rate. We'll give him the rate. Ben, my partner gave me. All right. Whoop. Hopefully, you guys enjoy today's Prototype stream. The cinema right now. Uh, thank you to everyone who participated. Uh, and then we're gonna be doing uh, I might stream tomorrow. Maybe not. Really old kits. But and we're gonna we give him a rate. It looks like he's doing something pretty it. cool, um, pretty unique on Twitch. a little bit of an update. So I'm gonna start the raid now. Dude. What is this guy's name? DSS Terrain. Just look over it, and it's just like stream. It's just right. like potentially going, stream tomorrow. Going, going. But yeah, hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Oh man! So uh, I will try to I'm give away more stuff whenever I can. Still gathering stuff in the subathon next week. Uh, so gosh, until that tomorrow or next week. All right. Stay safe. Thanks for the super live stream. Nice seeing you, Cass. See you next time, nerds. Yeah. See you, nerds. All right, have fun in this stream if you guys are going to stick around. Oh, wait. Our, uh, our, our raid message. We got to spam him. He's probably not someone who's going who's gonna to ban us for spamming his chat. So spam his chat. Make him feel overwhelmed with wholesomeness. Push-ups? Oh, crap. I'll do it next time. <laughs> I'm gonna reject him. <laughs> I haven't eaten all day. I'm hungry. I can't do push-ups. All right. Have a great one, guys. Bye-bye. Be nice. Represent the keyboard community well. Don't be toxic. Show him the way of nice keyboards. All right.